Welcome to Instrument Hub. Today I will going to discuss about the stroke controller which is used in chemical dosing. All over the industry is having chemical dosing. Why chemical dosing? What is the purpose of chemical dosing? This is all chemistry matter. This is some for purification, some for quality, quality, some chemical for uh, doing anti-corrosive. That is different kind of chemical available in each industry. What is the purpose of chemical? That particular flow we need to maintain each industries, so that we use the stroke controller. Why stroke controller using means we need to maintain and regulating the pump discharge flow. Percentage wise we can control the flow like control valve. So we are using analog input and analog output signal in this stroke controller. And various type of stroke controller is available. See this is one type of stroke controller is installed on vertical. Some is horizontal installation. Some is manual operator type. Depend on the pump stroke controller has to design on the various type of flows today i will going to explain you how to calibrate the stroke controller how we can check the stroke and how we can commissioning this controller on the field First we can see the various type of stroke controller. This is manual type stroke controller. It is horizontal type stroke controller with the analog input and output signal. This is another type of manual stroke controller. And last one it is vertical type stroke controller with the analog input and output signal i hope your guys understood the purpose next we can see how it is connecting and what is the parts of the stroke controller everything i will going to discuss we can see this three buttons one is menu another two is up and down button so we don't have the display on this board so that beside of the led the indication according to that indication we can recognize and analyze this stroke controller calibrated or not so the connection you can see a two cable came and connection over there on the tv it is the input cable and we have 230 volt power cable also it is the power cable connection and there is a transformer and uh, you can see downside there is a stroke motor so this all connection together going this board and uh, this is the main motherboard of the stroke controller this all stroke controller manufacturer is milton roy it is not repairable if any issue the concerned person need to solve this all problems we can do only calibration so next step is calibration so i will going to show you how to calibrate and how to stroke set this stroke controller in this calibration we are using horizontal type stroke controller you can see the coupling this is a coupling between the motor and stroke controller once you give the percentage or command it is rotating like percentage wise first step is we need to set the zero if stroke controller is not in zero we try to move and correctly keep on the zero this zero adjustment we can do by this push button first we need to push two times in menu button so while this green led will came so first we need to know which direction is going to zero is upside is it is coming to 100 then downside this red led coming then downside will keep uh, rotating means it is going zero before you set the zero always keep pin 4 milliampere that means from the plc or dcs they will give the command to zero then only you have to set zero properly you can see this coupling rotation has started 
up to reach zero keep it press on the push button once this this coupling and this indication reach on zero you stop and go for next step once it is reach on zero menu button one time press so that that red indication will coming that means zero properly set before started the red indication was upset once this stroke is properly set on zero the downside of the red indication will appear after zero setting we need to set span that means 100 so from the plc or dcs give command for 100 percentage then you have to again turn move up to 100 this coupling for 100 you have to press on top side push button once you press this rotation will start and it is move on the 100 side you can see this coupling rotation has started and it is like opening to move 100 percentage when you reach on the 100 you have to press again this menu button one time that means 100 already set and this led changed one press means if once you configure the output then you have to press one time if don't want output means again menu button you have to press two times then is this led going to change again downside and red led is came again that means 100 and 0 properly set on your stroke controller please carefully watch this video before you are going to do calibration otherwise if you have any doubt you can depend on milton roy controller manual then read very well then go for calibration before signing out i want to highlight one thing please subscribe and share my channel